so I don't know it's it's kind of a busy day for us but I really wanted to do a day in the life today because we're actually doing things other than me cleaning the house which is typically my daily vlogs um, yeah and I've noticed something I have been wearing my glasses a lot lately and I have contacts I don't know I've just I've, I've been liking myself in glasses a little bit more and my husband says he likes me in glasses better than contacts um, and I've always had the type of face that just looks better in glasses I guess but um, I keep moving my coffee over um, I don't know who keeps moving the sugar back over there um, but I don't know I think I'm going to buy a new pair of glasses like a more permanent pair of glasses and wear glasses more often um, I have always naturally had really bad bags under my eyes just like puffiness and just I don't know just bags under my eyes and I've had those since I was a little kid I mean I don't remember ever not having them and they're not really an indicator of me being tired or exhausted or not getting enough sleep or being stressed or any of that kind of thing it's just the way it's just the way they are um, so I think I'm going to start wearing glasses more often because I think I'm gonna wear glasses more often for that reason I just feel like they camouflage the bags under my eyes really well um, I don't know and my um, my contacts are constantly drying my eyes out and just just generally irritating my eyes so I don't know I think I, I may become more of a fan of wearing glasses and I used to wear glasses all the time never wore contacts really before um, but I done. yeah you're done uh -huh. thank goodness it only it has taken her I'm not even joking you guys probably about two hours to finish this one worksheet of cursive writing let's see how you did all right not too bad we need to work on focusing where where they live remember this is upstairs downstairs and in the basement you need to focus on where all of your letters are supposed to live like your F right here that's supposed to be upstairs too okay we don't have a basement oh Zoe <laughs> so not the point <laughs> here's the C here Fox Mom. hi so I'm sitting here, yeah, so I'm sitting here trying to get Zoe to focus on her cursive writing. Um, and while she's been doing that, I've been listening to my um, my audible.com book, the How to Win Friends and Influence People by Dale Carnegie. Yeah, Dale Carnegie. Um, it's a really good book. I'm enjoying reading it, um, or rather listening to it, because goodness knows I don't have time to sit down and actually focus on reading a book. But I love audible.com because I can do my other things and still technically read a book, I guess. But anyway, she's almost done. I always hate it because if we go a few days without doing homeschool, it is like pulling teeth to get her to focus and on anything and do her work. And then little miss over here keeps coming downstairs and <laughs> distracting us. And then the boys are home today and it, it's just a little chaotic. And they're upstairs playing in Zoe's room, but I've got the door open with like the baby gate set up. So I can hear them if they need me, but mm -hmm. she's back. <laughs> so, oh man, Piper. Mommy. You've got to stay upstairs, sweetheart. Mama, whenever it's a few days and whenever I don't do homeschool, it's like a little... And whenever we start it again, it's like looking for a needle in a haystack. Oh, there. I'm not sure that made sense, but okay. Um, yeah, and this one is supposed to be upstairs watching her naughty. Um, usually I don't mind if she's down here when we homeschool. Like, I'll set her up with some working on her colors or, you know, something at the table. But we're really behind on homeschool. And uh, we haven't done it in a while. Making. Honey, you're going to knock my phone over. Please don't do that. Uh, um, well. And uh, so she, I've been trying to keep her upstairs so we could focus. But she's not doing it. Mama. What? I'm getting my pony. You've got a pony. I see that. It's a pretty pony. A booty. <laughs> really? <laughs> Okay, I cut Zoe loose. She she took uh, about two hours, two an hour and a half to two hours to do this one worksheet. So um, I'm gonna give her a break. I think she's just having a hard time focusing and getting things straight. But we did 
we got our math done, we got our journaling done, and she's got her writing done. And she still needs to do phonics, but we're going to do phonics a little bit later. Um, yeah. So I'm going to clean all this up, and then I need to go check on the boys, and then I need to fix some lunch. I think I'm just going to, actually, I'll go ahead and start lunch. I think I'm just going to do um, macaroni and cheese for lunch because that's easy. And the kids love macaroni and cheese. I'll like pair it with some vegetables and stuff, but they love their macaroni. I have been drinking way more coffee today than I usually drink too. I keep leaving all the cabinets open. Oh my goodness. Um, yeah, my husband's supposed to be home in like two hours and uh, we've got to go to that closing on our new house. Not closing, oh, man, I wish it was the closing. <laughs> Um, we have to go to the uh, home inspection. Mama. What, sweetie? What? Mm. No, I can't hold you right now. Please, Mom. And for those of you wondering what my kids are eating for lunch today, they are having green beans, mac and cheese, um, some peanut butter and apples, and some raisins. And I just have some for the boys and for the girls. And those are those three trays. And then I'm going to blend probably some mac and cheese and green beans for Aiden. So he'll get to kind of eat the same thing. So now I'm kind of in a panicky mad dash to get all of our kids ready <laughs> to leave. It is currently 1.36 and my husband is going to be home at 2.15 to pick us up and we have to like leave like right away, like as soon as he gets home. Aiden is still in the bath. I still have to give Narkees a bath. I still have to get the girls dressed and I still have to get myself dressed because I'm still in my pajamas. So <sighs> crazy, 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 craziness. Um, and my house is a disaster in the process. But um, I'm trying to take Aiden's belt out of his dirty pants and put, the, put it on his clean pants um, so I can get him out of the bath and get them going. But at least they have eaten lunch, so that, that is a good thing. So I'm going to let you guys go for now. I'm going to go get all of that done, and I will see you guys in a little bit. Okay, so I managed to get all the kids ready. Yeah. We just saw a, a wreck on the interstate and the kids are upset that somebody got hurt. Um, but I got Narkees a bath, I got Aiden a bath, I got them all dressed. They're in really big sweaters, <laughs> but they have clothes on so that's all that matters. And we are going to the uh, our house's home inspection now. <sighs> And we have, what, six minutes? Six minutes to get there. I'm sure the home inspector will be late though. I'm, they are usually late with this type of thing. And then another realtor that isn't our realtor has to come and open the house for us. So at any rate. Okay guys, so we are in our new house um, and my husband and the home inspector are downstairs. Um, checking on some things. I think they're looking at the electrical box currently. The girls are playing outside with their Nana and I am just kind of hanging out up here with Narkees and Aiden and making sure they don't completely wreak havoc on the house. <laughs> so, um, and I'm not going to show you guys like the whole house or anything. I, I want to do like an official home tour later. So you're just kind of going to see what you see with me walking around a little bit. But uh, yeah, this is our living room. I don't know if y'all can see behind me. Mama. That's the living room. Um, but, and I'm going to do it, I'll do an official like before like house tour. Um, Mama. Yeah. Before we actually close or move in. Yeah. Or once we close and start moving in, so. And Aiden is, oh, sweetheart, watch out. And Aiden is back here. Aiden, did you find another door, buddy? He's messing with the door. So, I don't know. But yes, new house, it's so exciting. It's exciting to me every time we come over here and kind of look around. Um, it's, just, it's just nice to have a new space. Um, and there, it's a big bug. That's kind of gross. I'm not gonna show you guys that. But um, yeah, and the house has been vacant for over a year. So like insects and kind of a musty smell, that's to be expected. Um, and then this is, we're still debating on if this is, I don't know if y'all can see, if this is gonna be the girls room or the boys room. I voted the girls room because it's got two closets, but I don't know, maybe not. We might, I think the other room's a little bit bigger, so we might make that the girls room. But yeah, after we get done with this, we are gonna go to dinner with some family. 
And I don't know how long home inspections usually take. I would guess oh, like oh. an hour or two. But we'll see. Okay, I'm just gonna like give you guys a glance at the kitchen. It's like super small. <laughs> Like, that's it. Like, that's the whole kitchen. Um, so, and then I don't know if you guys can see, like, all the, the wood paneling. Um, all of the wood paneling is going to go. The kitchen needs a complete overhaul, which we can't do right away. But at some point, the kitchen is getting a complete overhaul. And our dining room has carpet. What? What? Why would you put carpet in a dining room? I'm, I don't understand that at all. I don't even know if y'all can see them, but the girls are outside playing. Yeah, um, all of this, that's our other lot as well that comes with this house. So that's super nice. Mama. <laughs> Silly girls. Okay, so we are done with the home inspection. It went really well. He said the house is like very structurally sound and everything looks really good with it. It just needs a ton, a ton of cosmetic work. Um, but it is 3,600 square feet, so it's not as big as it was listed, um, which is an issue we can bring up. Um, but yeah, we're, we're really excited. And now we're going to go eat and yeah, we're going to go eat, get some Mexican food. I'm gonna eat. Yes. Yes. Princess is a. Cute boy. So I don't even know if you guys can see me. It is dark. Um, I'm just going to go ahead and end today's vlog. Um, we are going home and, oh, like, oh, I'm all red, though. <laughs> um, but we are going home and we're going to get kids in bed. And then I'm probably going to clean up the kitchen and put on pajamas. And then I'm going to edit today's video. So um, that is it until tomorrow. And I'll talk to you guys later. Bye, guys.